Hello, and welcome to Art Snacks. Today we're going to draw simple machines. And this is going to be simpler than you think. <laughs> Maybe not. The first simple machine that we're going to draw is a lever. It starts with a triangle. And up on top, there's just a piece of wood or metal or something. Now think about a lever for a minute, and levers that you've seen before. At school, maybe on the playground or in a park, a seesaw makes it possible for you to lift a lot of weight on one side because the lever makes it easier. So that's one simple machine. Another simple machine, it's going to be very simple for us, let's go ahead and label, label that one lever. Okay, because it's a lever. Now, next, or a lever, um, the next one is an inclined plane. Now, how much you use an inclined plane as a tool? Well, we sometimes call it a ramp, right? And it makes it possible to take heavy things up into the back of a truck more easily. So that's an inclined plane. Inclined plane. Okay? The next simple tool we're going to draw is a wedge. And a wedge is something you can jam in between two larger things and break them up. So sometimes when you're splitting firewood, you can put a, a wedge in between two um, two parts of a, of a log. Let's say we got a log here that's got a crack in it, and it's a piece of firewood. Let's go ahead and just make this log here. It's got a little crack in it here. If we jam that in there, what's going to happen to the log? right? But if we try to take our hands and pull that apart, it might be really hard to do. So that's what the wedge does for us. It helps us take things apart or break things apart. So let's go ahead and Let's go ahead and label that. It's a wedge. Wedge with a G. There we go. A wedge. All right. The next one that I like to draw is a pulley. Okay. So what's a pulley do for us? Well, first let's start with an oval. And the part of it that kind of holds it up. All right. And a rope going over it. And someone can pull the other part of the rope. And does it make it easier to lift heavy things? Yes. You can talk to your teacher about exactly how much easier. This could be a very heavy thing here, and you can lift it a lot easier with this pulley than you can with your bare hands. So there's a pulley. So let's write that. Pulley. And last but not least, a screw. Drawing a screw is pretty easy because you've got a cylinder. It comes to a point, right? At the top of it. It has sort of a head on it. And this could be a Phillips screw, or a flat tip, or a flathead screw, but it has these little lines on it. And you can screw that into a piece of wood. And it holds things together very, very well, because you have every one of these edges here helping bite into the material that you screw it into. It also forms certain kinds of propellers. There are screw-type propellers, and I'll let you talk to your teacher more about that. So what were our different simple machines? The lever or the lever, inclined plane, wedge with an ugly G, screw, and a pulley. See you next time.